Hey everyone, Technoman here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix iOS 18 update paused on your iPhone. You're going to follow these steps to quickly fix it and update your phone. So let's get started. So the very first thing is to go ahead and retry it by going to your settings and then go to general software update. Sometimes it gets paused and then after a while it gets unpaused and it's working. So go ahead and try that. Now if it doesn't work, the next thing you want to do is go into where it says automatic update. Turn all of these off like that. Go back and then come back again to automatic updates and then turn all of these on as well. Now after you have done that, it's still not working, it's time to force quit the settings app and then go down and pull the control menu or pull it up, put your phone on airplane mode briefly and then turn it off as well. And that's as a quick network refresh for your phone. Now another thing I'm gonna recommend is that if you're using cellular data, switch over to a strong Wi-Fi if you can. Wi-Fi is gonna be your best way to update your phone because it is a big update so you want to do on Wi-Fi. Along with that is that you want to ensure that your battery is not using low power mode. We want to turn that setting off because it can interfere with activities like download. So we want to turn that off and then along with that is you want to make sure your phone is at 50% or more charge or if you can have it connected to a charger while it's doing the update it's going to be the best way to quickly update your phone. Now if you have done all of that the next thing you want to do is follow this method which is locate the volume up and volume down button and then this big side button. In this sequence you're going to follow, you're going to quickly press and release the volume up, volume down and then hold on to the side button just like that and keep on holding that side button until the screen goes completely black. While you're doing this do not uh, touch the screen or anything like that, just keep on holding that side button. You're going to wait for the Apple logo to appear and at that time you're going to let go and basically what this is doing is force restarting your iPhone by shutting down the software and reloading the code. So if it's a software related issue causing that update to be paused, it will fix it. Now if it doesn't work the very first time, this method can sometimes take a few tries to get the hang of it. So just keep on trying. Again, it's volume up, volume down, one after another, quickly press and release and then hold on to that side button until the phone goes completely black and reboots itself. Now along with that, if it's still not working, the next thing to do is go into your settings. This time we're gonna to go to general, go to iPhone storage here, and make sure that you have enough storage available for our update. Generally, with iOS 18, you need about 10 gigs or so. So if where you see I have 93 gigs here, you wanna make sure it's 10 or more. If it's not, go ahead and delete some app and clear up some space, or any videos or photos that you can remove that you can free up some space. Along with that is you want to go down here and check if there's already an update that's paused that's already trying to be downloaded. We need to remove that update so you'll go ahead and look for it. It's going to look something like this where it says in the screenshot how I have it, iOS update and just simply click on delete on wherever you see that. So you'll click on and delete update and then that will give you the chance to retry the update again by going into your settings general and then you go ahead and reinstall the update again. Now if that didn't work, the next thing you want to do is go into your settings, go to general, go all the way down here, so transfer reset iPhone, click on that, and then click on reset, and then that will give you the option to do a network reset. With a network reset, it will reset things like saved Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connected devices. Well, it's important to do that. The reason why that is because there could be a network connectivity issue that caused that software update to pause and you want to go ahead and do that. And if none of these methods work for you, most likely uh, you can update your phone using your computer on iTunes or the Finder app. That is going to be a separate video for you guys. I'm going to link that in the comment or the description section. You can check it out. That, that will take a little bit more effort to do if you're still unable to update to iOS 18 and it is being paused. And I hope this video is helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.